The Shark Navigator lift our deluxe feels reasonably well built. It has a mini plastic construction through a vent is made of metal. It's easy to take apart and reassemble since most of its components clip onto one another and but it could be sturdier in places especially its clear plastic dirt compartment which feels somewhat fragile. The Shark Navigator lift our DLX has many parts that need to be cleaned regularly. The dirt compartment is that you need to release the two clips on the side of the vacuum to pull out the dirt compartment. It can be opened from the top or bottom by pressing the separate unlock buttons. The dustbin should be emptied after every cleaning session and if I talk about the lint screen, the lint screen can be accessed by lifting up the dustbin's top cover. It should be cleaned periodically through no specific maintenance interval is given. Brush roll. The brush roll can be removed making it difficult to clean. If you want to access it, you can remove the vacuum head from the vacuum body and flip the head over. Use scissors or your hands to remove tangled hair wraps and other stuck on debris. Let's talk about the post motor or HEPF filter. You can access the HEPA filter by removing the font cover on the vacuum you should clean it once every two years with lukewarm water you must air dry any part of the washed out with water for at least 24 hours before using it the shark nv 360s dart compartment is good it's quite large so it shouldn't need to be emptied too frequently since it made of clear plastic and it has a maximum fill line indicator you can tell how full it is at a glance the Shark NV3360 has a disappointing range, its power cord is fairly long and allowing you to clean large areas without swapping outlets but its hose length is quite short which can be inconvenient when cleaning high mounted shells or other hard to reach areas. The Shark Navigator Lift Away Deluxe is reasonably portable, it's somewhat heavy but it feels light in the hand and it has a built-in carrying handle to make it easier to pick up and carry. The Shark Navigator Lift Away Deluxe NV36 has a couple of quality of life features. It has two floor type adjustment levels, bare floor 1 which is for cleaning bare floors like hardwood or tiles and brush roll on two which is designed to clean carpet. There is also a suction release control on the handle which you can slide open if you find the vacuum difficult to push around on carpeted floors or rugs. You can use the Shark Navigator Lift Away DLX in its upright position or as a semi handle head vacuum by uncoupling its canister from its body and cleaning it with its wand and hose. The Shark Navigator Lift Away Deluxe NV 3360 does not come with too many tools and accessories. There is a crevice tool for tackling messes in tight corners and upholstery tools for dealing with debris on fabric lined furniture. This vacuum also comes with a clip on tool holder. The Shark Navigator Lift Away Deluxe has a decent performance on bare floors. It has no problem picking up small debris like rice, but it had a hard time with pet hair as well as bulky debris like cereal and the weight is also very bulky. As is, a head can just pass over this kind of debris instead of sucking it up. Cleaning bare floors with its brush roll off also causes bulky debris to get caught on the unmoving brush roll. Thankfully, suction performance remains consistent as its dustbin fills up the shark and with 360 delivers quick performance on low pile carpet. It can suck up pet hair without an issue and clears the majority of both fine debris like baking soda and larger material like sand. Through you might still need to make another pass to clean everything, the Shark Navigator Lift Away Deluxe has impressive performance on high pile carpet, carpet and it can easily pick up pet hair and a good amount of fine and large debris as you can see in this video. However, it may still take you, you an extra pass or two or to fully clean some types of debris from the surface. The Shark NV36 360 has media core 
maneuverability and the rotating head helps when trying to maneuver around obstacles. However, the vacuum body is still quite bulky, making it harder to fit in tight areas or clean under tables and chairs when you are not using it in a semi handheld lift uh, configuration. The vacuum also gets stuck on tassels and it can move rocks around when its suction release is open. The Short Navigator Lift Away Deluxe NV360 is a satisfactory upright or canister vacuum. While it has a great performance on low as well as high pile carpet, it does not perform as well as the Short Rotator Lift Away ADV on bare floors, especially in regards to pit hair. Its bulky design it also makes it hard to maneuver and its short hose is a bit of nuisance when using it in a semi handed health lift away configuration. So that's all for my today's video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then do like, share, and subscribe to my channel and let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Thank you everyone. See you in the next video.